So, uh, former president of the Nigeria Bar Association and um, immediate past chairman of the Body of Benches, uh, Wale Olani Peko, called on President Bola Tinubu to constitute a panel to probe all past administrations in the country, and that includes Obasanjo's, Jonathan's, and Buhari's governments. Do you agree with him? I think that there is a need to probe the past administration there are many things that were done that were not done right they put us in the mess that we have found ourselves today you can abuse Tinobu as much as you want but it did not create the problems that we are going through today he merely tried to solve the problem so those who created the problems that uh, we found ourselves in, those who are simply taking money out of the system, they need to be made to pay for their crimes. They need to be made to surrender monies that they have stolen. I know that progress is being made on that. Some of these people eventually be made to pay for their sins. It's, it's not uh, enough to just behave like we are not aware that some people took so much money out of the system. Uh, they need to be made to pay for their sins. And we didn't just uh, find ourselves here. We found ourselves where we are today because of the inactions and, uh, and bad choices that some of our leaders made. And because of the greed of a good number of those who had been privileged, you have been privileged to rule our country, either at state level, at federal level, or even uh, uh, local government level. But crime is a crime. And when we investigate these administrations, we'll be able to know who committed what crime. And we'll be in position to recover from them what what has been stolen i'm 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 so interested in having them return what uh, they've stolen look at the former uh accountant general of the federation how can we have a situation in which one man steals about 110 billion and that when they took him to court he returned about 44 billion how can a man be in position to steal 44 billion naira? It's, it shows how terrible our system is that somebody can steal as much as 44 billion from Nigeria in these difficult times. And I know that there are many others like that who probably even got away with stealing more than that. So we will never get to them unless we put um, an investigation in place to find out what this person stole, what that person stole, and put people on trial recover what is stolen from them we need to do that we need to do that and look at what uh, uh Kwekun, son, said what has happened to the previous budgets and the trillions of naira allocated to road rehabilitation health care delivery security infrastructure rehabilitation institutional uh, rehabilitation among others the government must also interrogate the very profound question as to why the national currency, the Naira, has fallen almost from grace to grass with the Naira exchanging to one dollar at 900 Naira. The government must audit all past expenditures, whether real or otherwise. I agree absolutely with, with what this uh, eminent lawyer has said. If we can find the money that some people have stolen and kept abroad, or even here in Nigeria, we'll be able to put the money recovered from them to good use. We'll be able to do that. We just need to do that. We don't have a choice. We don't have a choice. 
surrender what you have stolen before we get to you. That's what government should say to these people. Mm. Tell them, surrender what you have stolen. Because if we have to discover what you have stolen by ourselves, you are not going to find it palatable. So, government has to let past administrations realize that they are not going to be left alone to simply enjoy what they have stolen. The government has to draw a line in the sand and say, from this point to this point, all that belongs to Nigeria that got stolen, we are on a mission to recover what was stolen. We need to do that to set the right example. And I will be happy to see the Bola Metinubu administration do that. Because many people believe that it is not ready to do, to fight corruption. Yeah. It has uh, many people around it that is corrupt and all that. But Bola Tinubu owes us that obligation. Right, Bikil. To recover what belongs to Nigeria that had been stolen and get us to put what we have recovered to good use.